Good afternoon, Carla. It's Friday. I wanted to try this standing thing as well. I thought it would be cool. It is a little bit interesting. I like it. I also tried to get it so where I had a little bit better lighting. Because my window is over there, but it's all blocked off. And <laughs> we're trying to keep out the draft because these windows suck and they get in a lot of draft. But I really liked your video from yesterday. Um, I'm going to say this now as a very concerned party. Please don't stop listening to the mountain goats. They're so good to you. Why, why would you do that to JD? He has been nothing but good to you. Anyway, I loved how you ended your video talking about bread because you know how I love bread. You know how I would do anything to go back and get fresh made French baguettes. Like, I... Oh, whew, that bread. I do really like the idea of us spending time together while we're abroad. I would love to take a trip up to England and go see you and Julie and Helen. I think it would be a lot of fun. And I would really love for you to come see me because I think I don't know that much about Spain and I don't know that much about where I'm going. All I know is that there are a lot of really great historical sites there and there's a lot of great architectural sites. So I'm going to Granada which is in the south of Spain. It was the last Muslim stronghold that the Spanish had while they were reconquering Spain after 700 years of Muslim rule. And one of their big sites is the Alhambra, which has beautiful archways and fountains, and it's just beautifully done. And all of their churches are really nice. Essentially, all European churches are beautiful and gorgeous because a lot of them have really gothic features and I did not think this video was going to end up being about architecture, but apparently it is. So this weekend we don't have a game, so I will be spending tonight and tomorrow writing a paper for my gender class. I also have a paper for my history class that I have to write. That's due on Monday. And Julie's show, Dead Heavy Fantastics, um, opened yesterday. So if anybody is in Connecticut, if anybody is ever near Yukon, um, there are, there's a show tonight. Oh wait, no, it, it actually, yeah, it opens tonight. Today is Friday. Um, the show opens tonight, and it is tonight and tomorrow. I don't know if there's a show Sunday, um, but there should be a show next Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, or just Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Um, so if you're in the area, I highly suggest you come see it. It should be a great show. And there's a part of me that's saying that just simply because my best friend is in it. But, like, I love theater. You can come see a good theater show. If anybody wants to come see that who is not Carla. Because obviously, Carla, you're not going to just pop on down here for a weekend just to go see Julie's show. Like, why would you? Meh. I met with my advisor. And I went through the list of all the classes that I have to take to get my degree. I am currently working towards a culture and communications degree in Spanish. And I have to spend at least a semester abroad, which is why I'm going to Spain. I wanted to spend the whole year because, like, why not? Um, and I can get up to 12 credits, which is four classes, that can contribute directly to core classes that I have to take. I can actually show you the paper. So this is my paper that I have. It is the Spanish Major Plan of Study. This is actually the old one, um, but it, it still applies. Everything's the same. So I went through it with my advisor, and it's really hard to see because you wrote in pencil, but everything that has a random thing on it, yeah. So it shouldn't be that hard for me to get all of these classes. But the hard part is actually like enrolling in the class because I'm only a sophomore, so I have a really kind of crappy pick time. So I know a bunch of people who have already picked their classes and I can't pick until next week. What day is today? Today's the 26th. So is it the 26th? Yeah, it is. So I have five days until I can pick my classes. And I have three days in between when I pick intercession and when I pick spring semester, which is weird, but it's fine because I'm I want to take a class in the intercession. Hopefully, I get into it. There are only twenty seats. Um, 
So, I don't think I'm going to be that far behind. The hardest class to take is 3242 because every culture and communication major has to take it. And then there are the people who are just like, you know, I need a class to fill up my credits, but I've taken three years or more of Spanish. Let me just randomly take this class. And I'm like, no, I need this class. And then they're like, no, but I want to take this class. And I'm like, no, I hate you. Leave. Go take a women's studies class. That'll be far more beneficial to you. But I'm not bitter. Carla, I'll see you tomorrow.